humans, we like to take very complex stories and make them simple. And on one level, that makes a lot of sense. I came from a religious community that I didn't fit with. So I was kind of uh, ejected from my family and my community at a very young age. So I didn't have the support that I really would have liked to kind of succeed at education or other things. Lately, I have been leading research into kind of social impact uh, digital projects such as uh, the service that measures the gender pay gap or the government service that encourages organisations and businesses to disclose information around any modern slavery they may have had or may have in their supply chains. In the last seven years or so, actually to kind of find out that level of information has been quite difficult. What I'm interested in is what the data is and what the narrative is from that data. So at the moment I'm doing lots of things because I'm trying to interrogate that problem for myself. Where could I be of most service? I uh, spend a lot of time on spreadsheets. I spend a lot of time on meetings and calls. I spend a lot of time mentoring people who work with me. There is so much data out in the world now. So this bigger picture about wanting to have a part in kind of creating what I view as positive social change. And maybe I can put that bit down a bit and continue with the things that are more interesting to me, which is, right, we've got this information now. What does it mean and what are we going to do with it? You're kind of stripping all of that away to get those points of information and then you start again with it. You kind of rebuild from it. But what I would like to do is probably more of that writing, really, that more creative element. The bit that I've been doing is spending that time getting to the objective information in order to do that compelling storytelling around it in the right places to the right people. Data is a means by which you can start to tell these simple stories, but not on its own. It makes up this larger, much more complex, interdependent world that we all know that we live in.